A crowd of over 1,700 on hand to witness this one. And Dr. Eddie Floyd, a key booster at the University of South Carolina and a Florence native, threw out the first pitch. He's a big reason for this game happening. And the Patriots, they came to play. Scoreless in the bottom of the third. This is Tyler Hibbs with the RBI single. The Patriots jump out to a 1-0 advantage. They weren't done there. Still in the third, Buddy Sosnowski, the RBI single to center. That made it a 2-0 Patriot lead as Adam Westmoreland, the Gamecocks starter, gets an early exit. The Patriots would score three in the frame. Top of the fourth, the Gamecocks get on the board. This is Christian Walker, and there was no doubt about this one. A bomb to left field. Solo shot for Christian Walker makes it a 3-1 game. Top of the fifth, the Gamecocks get within one as Dante Rosenberg delivers with the RBI single. But Francis Marion would load the bases in the bottom of the seventh with reliever Evan Beal on the hill for USC. This is Steven Tarkenton, the biggest hit of his career. This plates two. Francis Marion takes a 5-2 lead. An RBI ground out in the ninth got USC within one, but the Patriots are able to lock down the upset. There's the final out as South Carolina is stunned in Florence. Five to four, Francis Marion pulls off the shocker at the expense of the Gamecocks. Oh, uh, it's hard to even describe anything. It's just, just a feeling of, I mean, amazement right now. It's a great feeling, that's all I can say. It's not, it's big for the community. It's not really big as in, as in what we're trying to do this year, but he told us to have fun, we have fun, you know, it was a blast. We'll respond, our, our guys are resilient. We, we play in a league where you don't win all the time and you have to bounce back. And our guys understand that Francis Mary is good and we respect them. And we knew that it was uh, extremely possible that we'd get beat here tonight if we didn't play as good as we needed to. And that was the case, but we'll bounce back. Tonight's game marked the first ever played at Francis Marion's new Sparrow Stadium. It's part of an $11 million new athletic facility at Francis Marion that will be the home to the Francis Marion soccer programs as well as softball. But for now, the crown jewel is the new FMU baseball stadium, which is on par with the best in all of Division II. I wouldn't change a thing. You know, the, the administration and our athletic director, Dr. Carter and Murray Hartzler did did it the way I, I would have done it, and uh, I'm very appreciative to those guys. You know, it's obviously something that we've wanted and uh, thought for our student athletes, and to finally have it happen is just tremendous. You know, we really, uh, I feel great for our baseball, softball players, and our soccer players that we can give them this type of quality facility. 